when I came into the Senate, uh, I had a meeting with the then administrator of the EDA, and, and I felt that we had been ignored, and I, I didn't feel, and I felt like the EDA was created for states like West Virginia with distressed communities and great ideas, and I felt like we were, we were just uh, not maximizing our, our potential. I've really made a point to tell the EDA that West Virginia deserves our fair share of this funding, and I've worked to make sure we get it since that time. The Economic Development Administration is awarding $6.7 million worth of grants to West Virginia. $4 million in new grants, all focused on revitalizing Brook and Hancock counties. It's about creating jobs, it's about creating a vibrant uh, economic opportunity and environment for investment. Senator Shelley Moore Capito announced a grant from the U.S. Economic Development Authority. The agency gave the area a $1.5 million grant to be bring water service out to local areas. The investment is around $10 million. Starting out, this plant will create 40 jobs, and that number is expected to grow to more than 100 jobs. The uh, EDA is, has been uh, increasing its presence in West Virginia. Has We have our own state director now at my insistence. We've also, I have a list here of the projects that EDA has worked with, uh, 2,100 jobs over the last three years. We've had $46 million worth of investments over the last several years. So not only have I increased the appropriations for EDA, the, the ability uh, uh, to expand West Virginia's footprint with EDA is just exponentially larger since that very first meeting I had in 2004.